I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays. Way back a year ago. I've changed for the better. Thomas here with Much Props. Gonna give you another recap video. It is 2023 officially. Today is January 1st when I am recording and releasing this video. And I thought it would be nice, like I have in previous years, to recap all the things that I have accomplished over the past year with the channel. Uh, this year has been extremely rough, especially in my personal life but I wanted to kind of forget about those things, move on and celebrate all the things that we have accomplished as a channel here on YouTube. So I have made a list of analytical things that I kind of want to discuss about what has happened as far as views and videos put out and all of that stuff that the YouTube algorithm gods may bless upon me. Um, I, I thought instead of me just sitting here and talking to you face to face with the camera that I could put on a little slideshow, we could recap all the things that I've gotten, you could have like a visual instead of staring at me. So without further ado, let's go to the recap. This, this way. <laughs> So what I'm going to do is play a slideshow in the background of all the builds from this year in order. So there are 8 weapons, 15 masks, 9 helmets, 13 other creative creatures or things that didn't fit in a category, and 12 armor slash costume pieces. In total, I made roughly 58 things. Some videos had multiple items in them, and it was a lot. I was very productive this year, surprisingly, and I I wanted to kind of just recap all the things that I was able to accomplish. So this video is going in order and some of my favorite builds were the past two that you just saw. My Iron Man Templar cosplay was finished this year and I started my Link Viking cosplay which I'm still working on. I gained roughly 3,500 subs this year, put out a total of 52 prop videos, had roughly 565,000 views. Most watched this year was my Mr. Knight's template video. It got roughly 21k. I know it's not really a lot and typically you measure somebody's success by how how many views they had, how many clicks, how many whatever, but I thought I did pretty good this year as far as putting out pretty decent content. I updated several pieces of my equipment for this year, improving sound quality and video visual quality. I got new mics, new lights and I don't know if you noticed from the last video but I, my wife bought me a new camera for Christmas so definitely trying to improve things here and there where I can. I finished my Knights Templar Iron Man mashup from the beginning of this year and had my first professional photo shoot which was pretty awesome. Thank you Julie for taking some amazing pictures. I got to test out that Enlighten kit that you saw on the Viking Link cosplay from Shannon Hoover over at Enlighten and it's a pretty awesome setup. I plan on doing more things with those lighting kits. I had big ambitions to make three full cosplay builds this year and only made it through about 90%. You know, you have ambitions and life just kind of gets in the way and you get busy with other things or get distracted. So I will definitely try and finish up my Viking Link here pretty quickly in the new year and start my Ghostbusters and Red Hood builds. Eight days ago, I hit 5 million views on my channel, which is pretty cool. It wasn't like a big celebration or to do or even something that I was tracking. It was just one of those things that YouTube told me when I logged in and I was kind of shocked and blown away that, that I had hit that many. On my channel, which is my current sub count is 45,557. I've almost 300,000 hours of watch time from all my viewers across 453 videos. I tried my best this year to not necessarily focus too much on what would be clickable, what would be the best thing for people to watch, what would be the thing that they're all trying to find out and just went with things that I wanted to build. I was able this year to knock some of those things off of my list that have been on there for quite a while. The Predator Mask 
the Maximus helmet, Casey Jones mask, Spawn, and Deadpool are all things that I've been wanting to make for quite a while and finally got around to doing them. I also did some nostalgia builds that definitely hit close to home with the Krang from Ninja Turtles and the Toon Gun from Who Framed Roger Rabbit. I also really enjoyed making some of those crazy monsterized videos like the pencil and the candy corn. Not necessarily things that are highly searchable, but things that were stuff I just wanted to do at the time. Things that inspired me. This was my favorite video of the year was that who inspired me. It was nice to talk about all the people that give me motivation to do what I do. And I ended out the year with some Christmas builds, which this is way more than I've done in the past. Usually I get about two Christmas builds in and this year I ended up getting four out, which was pretty cool. Hopefully you enjoyed what you saw this year and I'll continue to be able to put stuff out for you guys. I could not continue to do this without the support of family, friends, my awesome wife, and you guys. So truly, thank you. That's pretty much gonna wrap up this video. Once again, thank you from the bottom of my heart for continuing to come on week after week and support my channel. The community that we are building is super positive and really does keep me motivated to keep coming back week after week with builds. So hopefully you're enjoying what I do and will continue to watch and share and let other people know what's going on on the channel. Hopefully, fingers crossed, 2023 will jump in subs and uh, get some new opportunities that maybe we hadn't had in the past. So inevitably, somebody's gonna ask you, how'd you make that? You can give them one of these, tell them much props. Um, like, share, subscribe, all that other YouTube stuff. Peace out. I ain't going back, I'm not falling. I'll push all my chips and call all in. I'll bet on myself, you keep stalling. I hear destiny and it's calling. I'll keep my head up high through the downs and lows. And we're all going life. Still nobody knows, but I'ma choose what's right and take what comes and goes. And ain't no one in life holding me back no more. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But I'll be okay, I move on each and every day The past is where it stays, way back a year ago